What if I told you? Happiness could be calculated, yes. Not just felt, but measured, optimized, and even predicted, all with the power of mathematics. In this video, we'll explore the math of happiness, how probability, decision theory, and optimization can actually guide us to live happier lives. Sounds impossible? Stick around. The equations of joy might just change how you see your own happiness. One of the simplest, yet most powerful, happiness formulas comes from expectations. Happiness can often be written as H equals sign R, E, where H is happiness, R is reality, and E is expectations. If reality is better than what you expected, you feel joy. If it's worse, you feel disappointment. Show a stick figure waiting for exam results. If they expect 50 marks but get 70, happiness bar rises. If they expect 90 but get 70, happiness bar drops. Life is uncertain. Every choice we make has outcomes with probabilities. Let's say you're deciding whether to go out with friends or stay home and study. Going out, 70% chance of fun, 30% chance of regret. Studying, 50% chance of feeling accomplished, 50% chance of stress. Mathematically, you can calculate the expected happiness value of each option, just like gamblers calculate expected winnings. Economists and mathematicians use something called utility theory to measure happiness. Imagine you assign numbers to life choices. Eating your favorite meal, equal sign 80 points. Watching a movie, equal sign 60 points. Solving a math problem, if you're a nerd like me, equal sign 100 points. Your brain is constantly solving an optimization problem. Maximize happiness, equal sign. Choose action with highest expected utility. But here's the catch. Happiness doesn't always grow forever. Economists call it the law of diminishing marginal utility. The first slice of pizza, pure joy. The fifth slice, not so much. The tenth slice, probably regret. So if happiness can be calculated, what's the best formula for lasting joy? Some researchers suggest this. Happiness equals sign, pleasure plus engagement plus meaning. Pleasure, enjoying the moment. Engagement, being deeply absorbed in what you do. Meaning, feeling part of something bigger than yourself. Three glowing circles, pleasure, engagement, meaning, overlap into a happiness Venn diagram. Here's a mathematical twist. When you lower your expectations, the E in our first formula decreases. That means the gap RE grows bigger, making you feel happier. This is why gratitude is so powerful. By appreciating what you already have, you mathematically increase your happiness score. Expectation bar lowers, reality bar stays the same, happiness bar shoots upward, background turns golden. Decision theorists suggest we can optimize happiness by balancing three things. One, short-term pleasures. Two, long-term goals. Three, reducing negative probabilities. It's like solving a life equation. Maximize happiness.